Saxon course 2, lesson 70, is on volume. So here I have a rectangular prism constructed of unit cubes. The volume is how many cubes? So to find the volume of the prism, we calculate the number of cubes it contains. You can see that there are three layers of cubes. One, two, three. Okay. Each layer contains three rows of cubes. So one, two, three rows, okay, and four cubes in each row. One, two, three, four. So three times four is 12 cubes. So we know that there are 12 cubes on each row, per row. Since there are three rows, I'm going to do the 12 times the three rows, which is equal to 36 cubes total. Okay, with this next one, if you wanted to find the number of one centimeter cubes that can be placed inside this rectangular box, first you're going to figure out how many cubes there will be on the base. So since the base of the box is five centimeters by four centimeters, you can put five cubes by four cubes on the base. There are, so there are 20 cubes on that first layer. Well, since we have three centimeters high, that means I'm gonna have three rows to fill up this shape. So I'm gonna take those, that 20 cubes and multiply it by the three rows. So I end up with 60 cubes in the whole box. Okay, this one wants to know the volume of the cube. So since the base is four by four inches, that means that I can fit 16 cubes on the base of this shape. Now my height is four as well, so that means that I'm gonna multiply the base, 16, times the height of my object, which is four. 16 times four is equal to 64 inches cubed. Okay, with volume, we always do inches cubed. So the formula we get to find the volume is equal to the length times the width times the height. So the length of my object was 4, my width was 4, and my height was 4. So 4 times 4 times 4 is equal to 64 inches cubed. So with this volume, I need, of this solid, I have to divide this into two pieces. So I'm going to divide here and make it into a rectangular prism and it looks like it's going to be a cube. So I have to find the length of the missing side. So this is going to be four centimeters for the height of my small cube. Okay, and then this will be four centimeters because then this one is four centimeters for the height of this rectangular prism. So let's find the, the volume of my cube first. Okay, so my cube is going to be 4 times 4 times 4. Okay, so because that's length times width times height, which is equal to 64 centimeters cubed. Now for the rectangular prism, again I'm going to do length times width times height. So my length is eight centimeters. My width is four centimeters. And my height is also four centimeters. So if I multiply it together, I end up with 128 centimeters cubed. Both those should be cubed, sorry. And now I'll add that together. So 128 plus 64 is equal to 8 times plus 4 is 12, carry the 1, 6 plus 3 is 9, 1. So my answer is 192 centimeters cubed for the volume of this entire solid. And that's it for this lesson.